What's going on, Zeofox fans? If you watched one of my more recent videos, you'll understand that I've been having issues with the printer back there. But, not to worry, I figured it out, and I'm going to share it with you. So I recently purchased the E3D V6 hot end and I've been having some issues with it as far as the filament getting jammed up at the nozzle and I couldn't figure out why for the longest time and it was driving me absolutely up the wall and print after print and fail after fail after fail I, I was about to give up. I, I really was. I was going to go back to the old hot end that was on there and just call it a day and say, yep, I throw in the towel, I'm done. Well, taking a step back, I remember that I have a product that is a lubricant and it's pretty, pretty good with uh, temperature resistance. And so I thought I would give it a shot, you know, taking a long shot in the dark and actually lo and behold it actually did what I was hoping it would it lubed up the inside race where the filament actually feeds through and I've done probably three or four successful prints now one of which was somewhere in the neighborhood of 18 and a half hours I don't know about you but 18 and a half hours at a little over 400 degrees with one, no burning smell of oil, two, nothing caught on fire, and three, no jams at all through the entire print, I would say that is a problem solved. The product that I'm going to share with you is available to you on Amazon, and I will put a link in the video description below. And so you can get your own if you are experiencing any jams in your hot end. It doesn't matter if it's the E3D V6 or, you know, some other brand hot end. It doesn't matter. This will still work. It's Milcom MC3000. Now, this stuff is some of the best lube that's out on the face of the planet. I swear to you on my channel that this stuff will work for any and all lubrication needs that you will ever have with quite a bit of everything. Whether you got a squeaky door, tripod is stiff and doesn't want to move, your 3D printer keeps jamming, you name it, this thing will probably fix it. But up to 400 degrees for 18 and a half hours, I know for a fact it works. Non-toxic, non-flammable, and environmentally safe. So this stuff is perfect for all you tree huggers out there. I am one of those at times. So my suggestion, get one of a bottle of these. You don't have to get such a big bottle because quite a little bit of this goes a hell of a long way. Uh, let me put it to you this way. I put four or five drops into directly into the hot end and coated the filament at the very beginning with the lube, and I've had zero problems since. This is just my suggestion to you guys. This is what I found works absolutely the greatest in anything that I've tried yet. I suggest getting a small bottle because I looked it up on Amazon and it gets pretty pricey for the bigger amounts. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up if you found it at any and all way, shape, or form helpful. Hit that dislike button if, well, you disliked it. Either way, it lets me know what you guys like and I want to bring more videos that you like. So hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, do all that fun and happy social media stuff, and I will see all of you on the other side of the interwebs. Take it easy.